Alright. I think we live. And it's your boy K Blau Hood X. Make sure you sign up for HoodX.com as usual. Um For sure. She nigga Pomo. No. Yeah. Some of y'all know Chromatic from uh, God's Speed. Give you the proper introduction. I'm trying to introduce you. Oh, all right, go ahead. You're fucking up already. We ain't even. God damn, niggas. Get this in a minute. Come on. All right. Get it it's in. your boy K Blau Hood X. Now, if you follow my channel, you probably already familiar with the topic of what we talking about tonight. Uh, we talking about Joel Steen, He's a Pikes. Now, if you're familiar with my page, you know I go in on Pisces. You know that you already know what it is. All right, so. I didn't want to do the same type of rant. I wanted to bring in my teacher who to give me a, a lot of uh, you know insights from not just comedics but also just common sense and, and just the Chicago Shire. Actually it's international. He just have a a, a a a certain way of looking at things that's very rare. Now me, you familiar with my channel, you know I speak in a lot of, on a lot of different topics, but mainly we try to keep it under astrology umbrella. So what what, what this brother is going to do is I'm going to keep it under the astrology act and, and he is too, but he's just, I just wanted a different type of energy with this video only because it's so special and the topic is so scandalous. So I want to, I want to give us a proper introduction to, like I said, my teacher, and 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 just a different energy to the to this video altogether. I want to introduce my brother Pomo of Godspeed.com. Po, what's up, fam? What up, family? Godspeed, baby. Some of y'all know me as Pomatic out there. I do the intergalactical talk, you know what I'm saying? The I am Pomatic under the Godspeedmeeting.com writings, you know what I'm saying? I just threw the set address out there. You really need to read that. You know, that's actually the, the map of these times. That's exactly what you see. You know, that's that said himself, you know what I'm saying? And that's him talking to his legion of demons. But yeah, but uh we're gonna chop it up, you know what I'm saying? Under the Joe Osteen neck I hear, you know, he a Pisces, I ain't know that. So this 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 is gonna be very interesting, you know what I'm talking about? Right. Now you did a whole video that had already addressed this issue and this was kinda it inspired this video because I just wanted to add on to some of the things that you were saying. But also um, this video was kind of like the universe was telling me to do this video and that like uh, somebody had left a comment on my page you know because I had been going on a rant after like what happened with uh, Bobby Valentino when he got caught with the uh, the transvestite in the room I mean well uh, you know the dude whatever in the room and then that had added on from what happened with Bow Wow you know the stuff that happened with uh, Robert Kardashian the stuff that happened with um you know, and then with Floyd Mayweather and, uh, you know, he, him and uh, Conor McGregor going back and forth. There was a lot of stuff that's happening with water signs, but especially Pisces in general. You know, uh, the drummer, he killed himself. You know, one of Pisces was a uh, famous drummer. He killed himself. Um, so, and I just kept putting out content after content after content, just showing what was going on with Pisces. You see what I'm saying? So, when this right. happened, you see what I'm saying? I had a video on, it was called, I had a video on my page called Water Signs of Blameless. And somebody came on there and had left a comment saying, man, I had to come back and, and check out this video because I wanted to see what was going on with Houston because of uh, what was going on with uh, Joel Osteen. And turns out he was a Pisces. Now, mind you already knew Joel Osteen was a Pisces. And when I saw this happen, I didn't really think twice. I didn't realize it was as scandalous as it was. because I didn't realize the media was going to take it and make it as scandalous as it was. You see what I'm saying? But... Right. But at the time when she left that comment, I was like, yeah, okay, I knew Joel Steen was Pisces. I knew what was going on in Houston, but I saw that, like, the universe was confirming the shit that I was saying. Like, people was coming to me with information, like, yo, look at this file, look at this file. So no sooner than that, the next day, I'm scrolling through my feed, and I'm, I'm looking at your page. I follow your page. And then I see you got a whole, you know, 45, 50-minute video up break, breaking down exactly what I had already been thinking and what somebody else had already brought me. And you had a whole video where you had a whole ill ass. It was a classic video. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I'm probably going to leave a link in the description. You know what I'm saying? So anybody can check it out. Now, now which was, had me even more like, damn, okay, like the universe is calling me to, 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 to address this. Now, before I even get into my chamber, I just wanted to, can you just give a recap or just, can you just 
narrate like what was your thinking going into that video or like you know what I'm, I'm gonna leave a link in the description so they can check out for themselves but can you just give me a quick you know synopsis of where your mind was at when you why did you put this video out the same damn reason you said that's how ill it is when you 100 when you got body supreme the same reason i'm scrolling through my shit i see a video of joe Osteen church drives hell and he ain't open the church doors but i ain't think nothing i'm like oh somebody crying about this dude whatever you know what i'm saying and then I see some more shit, you know what I'm saying, about um, he really ain't opening the church doors, you know what I'm saying? And I, then I see, you know, I keep seeing this shit. So, you know, I'm like, okay, whatever, you know, the nigga, you know. So I'm sitting there, and, and my wife, he asked me, you know, we sit on the porch chopping it up, and she really rarely asked me shit like this, but she said, hey, what you think about that Joe Osteen shit? And I said, what? You know, and, I, and then that's how the universe really going to tug at me to have my wife say it. So I'm like, oh, wait. Well, it is what it is, you know, the nigga supposed to open the church doors, um, you know, whatever, whatever, whatever reason it could be, don't open them as insurance reason, but that ain't good enough for the God's, you know, will. Uh, maybe he don't want to buy tell his church, that ain't good enough for God's will, so, you know, I'm trying to think of reasons, and I'm like, oh, this nigga really bogus. So I'll go back in my, you know, my, in my lab, and I'm sitting there, and I'm sitting there, and I see some more shit pertaining to, like, like Farrakhan looking at him, I'm listening to him. And the way he talking, he describing a Pisces, a Piscean nature. So I said, okay, damn, okay, cool. So I go back, I see another post of this, and something just kept tugging at me. Like, yo, get out on this nigga. Because I don't even think about this motherfucker. I was mad at my fucking... This one time where I was like, fuck dude. You know, like, right. toy ass. Like, but I keep seeing this shit in my face. So I had to address I said, fuck it, I'm going to address it. Not knowing at the same time, simultaneously, you was going through the same situation. So we did, you know, we, I did address it. But now it's time to really address it, you know what I'm saying? Us together, you know, we got to put the fire on his ass now, you know, put the fire in the situation. The way the universe works for me and God body, we like, we like the, um, the hit man, you know what I'm saying? They, they, they send us a hit, and then we go hit the nigga. And how we hit him is we expose him. And after he gets exposed, then the rest of the shit fall down to shit from there. But Joel Sting is a powerful one because he's sitting next to set. So now we got to really, goddammit, address this properly. Plus, I put the set out there, set address for y'all to understand who he's sitting next to. That's why he's still able to go up there and, and throw the blue vein and have motherfuckers still up there clap, clapping and shit. But yeah, that's how I came about. I was getting tugged by the universe. And when you get tugged, you just keep appearing in your fucking face and you're not looking for it. So, you put the video out. Right, right. Uh, I thought it was a classic. And, um, well, you know do that to do i mean i understand what you're saying that i'm from a three-dimensional standpoint that the, the events that led you up to making the video but i'm saying like where was your mind that you know like like you know making like what what was are you are you mad that he didn't open the doors I, or are you like you know what i'm saying like how do you are you an emotional standpoint looking at it or like I, how do you look at the situation as far as well i'm a warrior so when I talk, if I talk with fire, then that's just a warrior spirit, you know what I'm saying? So that's just going to sound like that. But if I was mad, nah, man, that ain't even no reason to be mad. It's just I witnessed it, and, you know, and I felt like I had to expose him. But when a warrior go to fight, he got to raise that chi, he got to build that fire. So when I go, go to expose him, I had that shit come out warrior style because I had to raise that chi to come directly from the universe to get this message out the way it's supposed to be presented. And when you snapping like that, when you when you got you know, God in you, it ain't no Joe Osteen shit. You know, you don't sound soft. You don't. It's fire. It's, it sound like a motherfucker mad. It's, not, it's like damn, what's wrong with him? But in reality, them no, that's warriorism. You, you see, you feel, you hear. You know what I'm saying? But no, I'm not mad. My mad state was I was mad at my business, and he kept appearing before me. So I said, okay, let me check the charge and see if they're legit. Oh, they're legit. So I gave him the benefit of the doubt in my mind, thinking like, okay, what reason do he have if I was a god body not to open these motherfucking doors if it was me? It wouldn't be no damn reason. So I said, oh, okay, that was judgment. That was the halls of Matt. I was going through the halls of Matt, M-A-A-T, Mayak, you know what I'm saying, divine law. So under divine law, he supposed to open these motherfucking doors, and he ain't open them damn doors. So then uh, uh, the judgment with cash got them in sentence. I had to sentence his ass. Mm. So, so, as I'm sitting there talking to you, I find me, I don't know, can you see this? What that say? Yeah. Read that. Joe Osteen, luxury yacht, polo, and the death of him. What the fuck is that? See, I know, I'm sitting there talking to you, this shit just came up on my feet. 
<laughs> it said, it's, that. it's an article that just came out. It said, hold on, I'm going to read, read what it said. Hold on. The value, this, this line, I ain't, we ain't rehearsing oh. this or nothing. This shit just literally popped over my feet. Right? Oh, bro, on. let me see what you begin. Hold on. Look, I'm going to tell you, it's a Poe's law. It's a Poe's law boils down to this. Without a clear indication of the author's attempt at satire, a large segment of internet readers and wires will completely miss the satire regardless of how stream it may be. Okay, so I, yeah, it's, it's it's dealing in regard to what we was talking about in that like when you was when you was satiring like when you basically paint the picture like like tell me the story like like how you looked at it you said you said okay he's sitting on his bed what right. you saying and his wife what you saying how you said like like you, you paint said, a picture no, we never know that the nigga sitting on his bed you know what I'm saying at the time he's sitting on his bed butt naked but he got a, a, a shirt on you know what I'm saying a white motherfucker buttoned up um you know a uh, Jordi Armani shirt, you know what I'm saying? And she's walking around with the, with the Ann Klein uh, mini, uh, you know, nightgown on, you know what I'm saying? With no clothes, you know, just a nightgown. And he's sitting there with a sniffing crack, I mean, coat, you know, two lines and shit. And she cut the damn TV on, you know, she bored as hell because she two lines, so she's going back and forth, fast in a motherfucker. You know, he's sitting there, she cut the TV on, so as he's snorting the motherfucking uh, seafood, he raised up, he see this shit about him not opening the church doors. So he jumped the fuck up, like, whoa, you know, butt naked, dick swagging, you know, that shit, like, what the fuck? And she like, hey, what the fuck is this, you know? So that's, 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 that's what that shit is, right there. That's how it really is. That's what the fuck you don't know, you know what I'm saying? That's the shit that come out behind closed doors. That's that purge shit, you know, you do stuff, you white motherfuckers, you never know they got a, a nigga going to get a body so they can stab this bitch, you know, but on the surface it look like these motherfuckers come on and do shit. Yo, that's the, yo. the nature. You know, That's I mean, a joke. You, know, Pisces, you know what I mean? Pisces, I know it's just like that. Like, like when they get on camera, when they perform, it look perfect. But then, like, behind closed doors, you have no idea that, like, how this shit really looks. Yeah, that's the Pisces in nature, though. That's that's why he's, that's why we exposing his ass, because he got that in him. And he got it in him bad, because he's not God body. He, he's a matrix. He's matrix. So he, he really gonna be, it's really gonna, like, he's not gonna have remorse from sitting there tooting that seafood. You know what I'm saying? He gonna straight do it. And what people see in him is that you gotta remember the devil come in many color, shapes, and forms, but that nigga, you can look at him and tell he's the devil. I mean, he gonna act the role, play the role, look all nice and sweet. I can see straight through the motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, this nigga be at home smacking on hoes, fucking on fags and shit. You know, they wanna get fags from the hood. Um, the Ray Ray bring him over, that motherfucker, and he laid up in the other guest room butt naked, and they take turns going in there fucking him. In the, ma in the master bedroom hitting seafood. You know, you never know this shit going on. But you'll know it if you go to the hood. You'll hear about it. And you'll think this shit ain't real, but it's really happening. When I, like I said, I see a pattern dealing with a lot of Pisces is going through this exact shit right now. Is that like they being like, like like Bobby Valentino, like what you just said, like it sounds crazy, but motherfuckers forget that just what, like two, three weeks ago, Bobby Valentino literally just went through the, the basically half of what the fuck you just said type shit and like you never think that like he up in the hotel room somewhere with a dude like you know what I'm saying dressed up like a drag queen like until his motherfucker was up in the shit on the phone like and you look at Bow Wow the same thing happened with Bow Wow he put out the um you know the video and he got exposed with the Bow Wow challenge you look at what happened with uh what's his name Rob Pata you know the dude that was in the car crying when his girl pulled out the phone on him you look at, yeah. uh, you know, you look at, um, well, I, I can't think it was a drummer who killed himself in the band. I can't think of his name. Uh, this, um, he, but you gotta he see. killed himself. He put out an interview basically saying that, he, you know, he didn't want to live no more. And, um, hold on, I want to do this right. I don't worry about that. I'm trying to get the idea. But when is his birthday? He was a Pisces. You know what no, I'm when is your birthday? Say what? When is your old steam birthday? Um March fifth. Okay, the fifth. So his his thing is this. The fifth is the separation under the metal natu. It's when you say fuck that lower self shit, I'm gonna go on to the high self. That's when Jesus died and went to heaven. That's the actual ideology when you separate the lower self from the higher self. That's when you know you fucked up and you address the issue. His thing in life is as we look upon him and he said the and he got damn it, you know, he got hit with the, the act of separation, meaning is the flood came. Is you gonna separate that vanity shit and open up these church doors and go to God for real and do the God body, or is you gonna sit there and stay into the lower self? He 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 had to make that decision, and he don't know. It looked like he won because 
he failed the test, but everybody's still coming to him. And you say, well, what, what, yeah, it looked like he won, but no, it, it, all them people are fucking clones, robots. Them, that ain't quality people. What you see is a robotic mold that Satan may help him stroke his ego. What he don't really know is he's going deeper and deeper into the hole of, of, of the lower self. He didn't make it. He just separated. He fell into the lower self due to the fact that he didn't open the church doors until he was forced to. So now that saying that, he always going to be presented with this life situation. That's why I say he really lost. Because fuck who cheering for him, it's him who got to deal with this law that he go through every day in his life, every situation. He don't never know that he always going through this type of shit test where he got to separate that lower shit from the higher shit. And he fell that every time. So every time he fell, his ego gets stronger, his Satan get hands, his claws get set, claws get deeper. So I'm going to tell you how it really is. This time that, I'm going to tell you how, how much that Satan performed the illusion on his ass that he passed the fucking collection plate around. Why is shit going on? Right. Ego, now he ego to was to gone. He has to go to New York, too. He, he He's asking for collections in New York. Now he out in New York asking for money. To do what? To give to the help the people? And he you already is. know. You already know. Come on, man. How you gonna pass around? How can you think like this? Like, oh, fuck it. I'm gonna pass around the collection plate. His ego is being stroked, so his head is getting big, and he's digging himself into a deeper hole, just like all lower self Pisces do. Well, he told, he, said, he, said, he, said, he told the people don't have a a, 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 a bad attitude, basically. He said don't have a, a feel sorry for me, a, a, don't have this type of attitude, basically. Like, you know, feel sorry for me and poor me. He basically told him, you know, don't be like that. That's basically saying thank you for being like that. That's the price of nature. They're talking with two tongues. Got them and basically be like that. You know what I'm saying? He got to be the mortar. He, he, he lied, this. though. He lied, too, though. Like, if you go and look, like, the first shit that they said didn't even add up to. They ended up deleting. Like, they had put a response out on social media. You know what I'm saying? And then they ended up deleting the shit off of the page because motherfuckers had showed it that his, you know what I'm saying? They basically tried to say it was flooded. You know what I'm saying? But then people had pictures showing that it wasn't. You know what I'm saying? So they ended up right. deleting that shit off of the page. And then he doubled back and said that the doors was open. You know what I'm saying? Right. He rewrite history. Right. That's the Pisces shit. He rewrite history. He said rewrite history. Yeah, that's under the, the, the uh, Hood X Files, Hood X Lit, you know, Godspeed Lit, Science, uh, rewrite history. He pulling the wool over motherfuckers' eyes. He thinking that he can actually recreate the history just off him saying some shit and people gonna think different of the situation other than how it really act, happened. That's why he'll say, Oh yeah, my doors are open. My church did flood. And he'll keep saying that shit and she'll say, But it flooded sixteen years ago. But yeah, we did have issues and safety reasons and he throwing these cold words out there. So you hear flood, safety reasons, my church is open. Not saying the fact that my church wasn't open. He's just saying my church is open. Yeah, quite nice, he's open, you in the motherfucker. But he talking with the with the snake tongue, the double pitch talk, you know, the double fork talk. So the average sleep motherfucker's gonna sit there and go when the, like I say, three, four days from now, he's gonna say, Oh yeah, his church doors was open. Yeah, his shit flooded, but you know, the motherfucker like, nigga, what the hell, what the hell you hear that from? That's how it's gonna sound. There were also two on real you talking about Beanie Siegel got knocked out. I think that was his year too, right? Where he was talking shit. So, I mean he co wrote the song with with the game and he got punched in the face. And he went he went backstage. I mean he got punched in the face backstage and he had to still get up and go out on stage and act like everything was one hundred right after he just got knocked out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That, I call that a gift because she, if you can trick your man into thinking you didn't get knocked out that quick, so you know that's a fucking gift because I can't trick myself that's what like the that. Part, that's exactly what I was about to lead. That was what the point was leading to. Like we look at with Joe Osteen, like he can trick it's himself. Still oh, lights, he, camera, he, action. It's still lights, camera, action. He ain't, he ain't even flinch. He, you know why he didn't flinch? Because he don't give a fuck anyway. I told you he had the crib snorting cocaine, smacking the fags on the ass. Him and his wife taking charm jack ball on the back of the ass nigga. He don't give a fuck. That's what you don't know. That's why when you like that, you like Tommy on power. You can play the fucking role. You know, it's hard to, to give a fuck and do that. But if you like, nigga, nigga, I... I Shit, nigga, I have all these smack holes on the ass, triple clubs, I go to the other seas and get out, you know, ruthless shit, you know what I'm saying, shoot niggas, shoot animals, shit like that, and come back, he can play the role, because it's easy. He just don't leave motherfuckers go for it, that's all. Yeah, yeah I can see straight through that shit, you know how I know that he playing the role, because just in the real nature of the nigga was as holy thou as he was fucking portraying himself to be, opening them fucking church doors wouldn't even be a second thought. Am I right or wrong? How he look and how he play I said, himself from the I said, I said that even if he didn't open the doors, at least like 
They supposed to have he some media helped. on the page talking like, okay, we out here over here where the flood at, woo woo. Like he out there with a t shirt on to say the name of his church, and they out there, you know, passing out plates or passing out blankets. Like even if he did some shit like that, that was like okay, you know. Yeah, no, no, that's the catch. That's how. That's the equation. Age of Aquarius. The Piscean age is you really ain't gonna ask some questions. You really ain't gonna say that. But the age of Aquarius, we go by law. What's the motherfucking law? He could have been doing something. Did he do anything? No. Where was he at? Now, this is when the skywalk come in. This is when the supreme third eye come in. This is when you get to step out your body and travel to where he was at in that time in that dimension. And what I seen was that nigga butt naked sitting there snorting cocaine. Oh, you hear about it? You gonna hear about it? Watch. Like I said, like I said in the video, he gonna get up there. He gonna say, "Poor me, poor me. The world is against me. Those who say things are evil." He gonna say it that way and do all this this math program with his hands. But at the same time. Look what he said. We all motherfuckers did was brought them up on charges. Well, how is that evil? I'm holding you accountable for the shit they see. How is that evil? You see what I'm saying? So that's the Pisces shit. I'm a mortal. Poor me. The world against me shit. You know what I'm saying? And half the motherfuckers in the audience is water signs because they, they can sympathize with that shit. They can feel that shit. You know what I'm right. saying? Plus, they're not real. They're not synthetic. They're not genuine quality people. These are synthetic motherfuckers. They believe any fucking thing. Joe Osteen is like they Eminem. I rap Eminem. That's they great white hope. You know what I'm saying? That's the TDJ. They go back him just because he's white. Damn. Damn. Right. That's why I look like that. Really, really? lost. But Satan performed an illusion. He got a whole bunch of motherfuckers standing up clapping for this nigga. That shit is an illusion. That shit ain't not really real, Joe. When you think about the flood, like it's a movie called Life of Pi. Where, where the dude is stuck out in the middle of the water, you know what I'm saying, on a boat. It's really about Pisces. Like, every Pisces really should watch Life of Pi. You know what I'm saying? But, like, you think about the nature of a flood. Like, this is all Pisces sim symbol. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's a fucking flood. Like, this is right up his motherfucking alley. Like, he, he was supposed to jump right the fuck in. Like, this, he probably seen this shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? In his life, like... Somehow this nigga kind of knew. It's like chess. Under the fifth, on his birthday, fifth, 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 separate the so little self from the higher self, Heru, or Heru Kahati. He keep failing his chest. He knew what he That's was supposed to do. fuck with his yeah. subconscious more than it, the fact that it was a flood. Like, they could, it's a million ways, like, you know, different pastors get exposed. You see what I'm saying? But this right. way was like nature, and it was like flood. It's like Pisces. Like, this is, this all... Pisces synchronicity. It ain't like it ain't too many motherfuckers tracking this information the way I'm tracking. Like all this shit going on with Pisces, and then we get to this story, and it's okay. We got this preacher. You see what I'm saying? It's a Pisces, he a preacher. It's a fucking flood, and a nigga don't open the door. Like Pisces understand the synchronicity. If you follow my page, you a Pisces, you, and motherfuckers said they all like people on my page. They think I just sit and talk shit about Pisces. Like like I like I'm like I'm not. All I'm doing is showing motherfuckers these stories. Like, look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. But motherfuckers get mad at me. Like, like I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. But then you run to a story like this. Like, this is the motherfucking icing on the cake type story. It's like you got a Pisces, he a priest, yeah. and it's a motherfucking flood. Like, this is, like, you know what I'm saying? All the Pisces do right. How can like, you deny? How can you deny what the fuck? If you follow my page and all all these years, motherfuckers, all they say, man, you just talking shit. You don't understand Pisces. You just it's high, it's higher level Pisces. This is all this shit I be fucking hearing like every day on my page. You show them the right. the the why hey Pisces video. That shit got up to eighty three thousand views right now. Type shit. That's the most popular video I got on my fucking page. You know what I'm saying? And ever since then, I just been adding adding more content. And motherfuckers are like, man, you obsessed with Pisces? You talking shit about? It. I'm like, okay. Now, how do you explain this shit then? Because that's predominantly what's wrong with the world, G. Other than looking at what the content of what you're saying, they're looking at the way you're saying it. And they more gone and angered off the way you're saying it than listening to what the fuck you actually said. And that's what you got. We in the Pisces era, coming out of the Pisces era. So that's the predominant mind state. The fact that they're just like a child. They're like children. You know, the water is like the child. Instead of saying, damn. Because any other sign kind of peeped that, like, okay, I'm going to right, right. But them motherfuckers get mad like a child. Like, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. And it's right. fucking true. But they gonna get mad. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. You know what I'm saying? They ain't gonna just, they ain't gonna never admit to that shit is right. And what they gonna do is write that shit off in their mouth like it never exists. That's why I told you they good at tricking themselves. That's exactly what he did. 
He changed his story up like three, four times. Yep, yeah, yeah, because he didn't know which way to come. You know, he was trying to figure out which way to come, how to how to do this, you know, how to how to make, you know, he, they, like I said, they kill themselves. He, he said this shit, but then he didn't see the loophole, so he had to pull that shit back. He said this shit, he's like, oops, damn, I ain't see that loophole. He pull. That's, you know, he keep doing that shit. So when he got there and talked to him, he finally said, then nobody asked him. It was too late, he seen him on his neck, and he's like, well, my church door's flooded. They show you this little green picture of his pool that looked like the water had, you know, some bullshit. You know, and, and, and he keep on trying to renege, but then at the same time, he do, he just keep going. He don't never stop to say, you know what, I'm full of shit. He just keep going till he find himself turning, you know, like that. They keep tricking themselves. Because ain't nobody around going to tell them about themselves, so they keep tricking themselves. Especially if ain't nobody telling them about itself. But everybody else is shit. That's a gift and a curse. Because now you, we can start to see, man, you tricking yourself, nigga. Who you think you fooling? That's them Pisces, that's them two fish. Shit like... You got man, they they all do this shit. They all do this. Shit. You gotta remember, like it ain't about him taking action. It's about the sermon. Like like he was like you said, he was probably sitting around snorting cocaine, thinking about what the next sermon was gonna. It was gonna be a, a great sermon because of, of the fucking flood. Like right, right. But you figure, goddamn it, two three nights before, like when all that shit boiled over to the media, he had to go back and change the whole sermon around based on like you know the shit that had happened and like that's all he been focusing on anyway like he not out in the streets passing out food and like you know what i'm saying bringing people into the church none of that shit like all he doing was thinking about making that motherfucking sermon and like this is that pisces shit it's like all the dream to them and then like they don't feel they gotta take action all they got to do is just talk and 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 motivate and say and believe and say this shit and and they good you know that's what that's I mean? easy <laughs> Say that's a pussy ass. That's a pussy ass path. That's an easy path. You know, to sit there and just keep doing that shit, and you ain't really gotta be do nothing. You can just keep saying shit. You know what I'm saying? And thinking that you worthy or anything because of the shit you say. But let a nigga do that or a nigga pastor do that. Nigga, they been out the game. That's why I say they, they possess off the blue vein, the white man, the pale blue eye. That that shit got them hypnotized because that's the shit they be seeing in church their whole life. That's why the black sister uh, side with this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how they think. They think like not enough to get to the point, but look at him. Don't do him like that. Not what he done. You know what I'm saying? That's how they think. That's why a good man never get his props. You know what I'm saying? Well, so crazy they'll say that, but then turn around and boycott the shit out of the NFL. Like the NFL really got anything to do with what the fuck? The real issue was fucking police brutality. That dude was protesting. You know what I'm saying? They didn't hire a dude back, so now black people is boycotting the NFL. Like. They ain't got shit. They niggas missed the whole issue. Like, the whole issue was police brutality, not boycotting the NFL. You know what I'm saying? Right, and niggas right. are quick as fuck to boycott the NFL, but, like, you got Joel Lundstein <laughs> doing his shit, and they were like, oh, don't, don't do that to him. That's the feminine mind. That's the, that's the actual part. See, man, that's the feminine mind, though. That's where you, like, okay, it's about commercial. It's about show. You know, I'm here with the famous guy who, who took a stance, and it's strictly off anything else, like you said, about the police killing, you know, brothers. It's just, as long as it's for show, it's cool. And we satisfied. Because you know that it's and when you don't know a motherfucker Pisces, man, like they good at hijacking your subconscious and like brainwash like they real good at performing like you look at the performance as Pisces, like a lot of them is some of the greatest performers in the world, you know what I'm saying? But like like you say, like behind closed doors, you never know how that shit really is. That's why a lot of times I people on my page, I'll be like, they be like, You man, you're so wrong about Pisces. I'll be like, Alright, well show this video to your spouse. Show all these videos to your wifey or, or your man. Like all these all these videos I got on my page talking about Pisces. If you think I'm just totally never... wrong, I'd be like, all right, take all these videos and just show them to your motherfucking. If you ain't got a girl or a man, show it to your, your brother or your sister. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't got no brother or sister, show it to your mom or your dad and just, or your best friend and just ask them, okay, like, do this remind me of you in any way whatsoever? And they're going to be like, oh, my motherfucking God, I ain't even think that somebody even put this type of shit together. Fuck all that. Fuck all that. Why they never do? That's the nature I'm talking about. Why don't they never do it? Why don't How can you know? How can you know some shit is right but still talk shit about it? That's that fucked up shit. Because you know it's right because they won't show nobody because they know damn this shit is right. But I'm gonna fuck them. How the fuck do that sound? Cause like my videos like watching pornos, man. But you watch that shit and you feel a certain way about it. But you'll never tell your wife or your nobody that you watch that shit. Like that's some shit you gonna keep to yourself. Because how about you just 
themselves. It's them, you just learn. So how about they just come clean with themselves, though, in the dark? You ain't got to tell nobody, be like, damn, I got to correct myself. Look they go right in that. Look at what he did. You think he going to, hell no, nah, he got right back up there and ask some people for their money. It's right there in front of your face. It's showing you, like, <laughs> they not programmed. Water signs are blameless. I got a video on my page. It's called Water. They blameless. Like, remember we were talking about the word reproach? You know what I'm saying? I think yeah. if you put me, I don't, I don't, there's a word called reproach. You know what I'm saying? It's like when you go to a motherfucker and tell them, like, hey, man, you fucked up. Like, they not, they not going to fucking pull the mask off and say, you know what, you're right, man, I fucked up. Like, you know what I'm saying? You look at hey. Beanie Siegel who had a whole deal with Rockefeller, all that shit, lost all that shit on some stupid shit for him going to jail. and had shit to do with Jay-Z, but then he ended up dissing Jay-Z, talking about fuck Jay-Z type shit. You're like, man, what the fuck? Nigga, you had every hey. opportunity in the world. You fucked that shit up. Like, you know what I'm saying? He ain't like, he gonna be like, man, you know what? I fucked up. Like, you ain't never seen Dean say no shit like that. Uh, they gonna blame it on something else. That's how they keep they self, uh, that's how they, they, they cure their conscience. They just keep blaming it on something else. That's how they cure that, that God voice in their fucking head. Like, nigga, you know you full of shit. So they find somebody to blame it on. They blame it. Or something. Oh, blame it. Like, it ain't my fault. You know, they satisfied with that ass shit. They good at tricking themselves, Joe. That's a very dangerous trait to have. You know, it's not really cool to be around a motherfucker who trick themselves because that's no them. You know what I'm saying? It's all external shadow walker shit. You know, their emotions, their heart, how they feel. They follow their heart, goddammit. External forces got weaponry. They control the heart and the feelings. So you really dealing with an AI instance. You're dealing with a, 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 a computerized personality. You know what I'm saying? We could call it. Which I call shadow walking shit. Let's get yeah, let's get ancient and, and spiritual with it. You know what I'm saying? They jump in their fucking bodies. Simple as that. It's easy. These wishy washy motherfuckers. There's no them. You know. So since there's no them, they become them. You know. That's too much doors open. You come to you come to pole. You come to earth. Asian shit. I'm me. You come to earth. Air. I'm me. You know. Ain't nothing ain't going on. All that. I'm a, I'm gonna check myself. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, I don't know, I can't not be out here opening the church doors and get up there and say a sermon. How the fuck can I do this with this shit, if this voice of God pounding in my fucking head? Like, nigga, you full of shit. The only way I can do that is I got to be totally evil. I got to be on some cannabis ass shit. You know, I can do it better. The three, Go five, ahead. five in Tarot is uh, the Herophant. And the hair font is basically the Pope. This is in the major arcana. The major theme of five is the hair font. And that's basically like questions and answers. Or like, you know, the king, the emperor, the person that's higher than the emperor, the person the emperor got to go see, the person that the king answered to, he answered to the Pope. He answered to the church. So, you know what I'm saying? So, right. so that's his birthday, three, five. So, like I said, five is hair font. But when hair font breaks down into the water, into the cups, like, so you get five of cups, basically. That's his life card, which is a picture of the dude standing there with the black, with the black, uh, you know, with the all black robe on with the hoodie. He then kicked over uh, three of his cups and he cried over the spilled milk. But he, he still got two cups over here that, that he could be acknowledging, but he mad because he didn't knock these three cups over. He got the black hoodie on. He out there crying, feeling sorry for himself that he kicked, he's crying over spilled milk. Dark shit. Yeah. That's his life card. You're under, you know, March 5th, 3-5. That's, that's, that's his chamber. So you kind of see that, like when the when the when that when you got the hair font though is the major influence. That's the the pope. That's it's the, that's the major influence. You got a picture of a pope standing there like this with two. And that's him. Two, two, you should that. That's and, him. Right, but when it play out in water, it's gonna play out with the black cape on. This is what I'm trying to tell you. Him sitting there crying over spilled milk. So like, and they got a big ass river, a big ass flooded river. You know what I'm saying in the background. So so. It play out. It play out half cock, man. Like you know, like they say, the left brain be fucked up, and they're like, okay, if you had the left and right brain right, it would be the Arafat sitting there with the two with the two people coming to him, you giving them the answer. If he had the left and the right brain going, you dealing with Pisces right. two right brain. It's like the the uh damn, I always forget that shit. What is that shit called? The autistic autistic motherfucker, like like straight right brain, like the left brain ain't clacking. So it's gonna play out him sitting there with the with the black hoodie on, crying over the spilled milk. But that's exactly what the fuck he going through right now. And then, like, you know what I'm saying? He had he had five cuts, but he kicked three of them motherfuckers over. And it's like, damn. Like, and now he's sitting there crying with the black hoodie on. So, like, you know what I'm saying? He, this is his major, this is the theme of his life. You know what I'm saying? If you don't know, if you don't, man, water sign cards is, like, the most dramatic cards in the whole motherfucking, like, Tarot deck. Like, you know what I'm saying? 
they story it's like up down up down up down like where some of the other ones it kind of level then go up then kind of level then come down like they shit every card is literally like bipolar it's like doom, 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 doom. you know what i'm saying so like he got a good good for they gonna give him a, a good gift for gas but that's it yeah you know that's, it. that's it that's it So when it's come time to show and prove, he gonna drop the ball every motherfucking time. Every time. That's the water shit. They like you said, they, they, they feel good to sit around talking about this shit and, and letting the adrenaline and the dopamine receptors dance around in their head and seeing and they 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 can live with that. Because that's a, like like you say, uh, now go back to the metal net on the fifth stage, he's not separating that shit until he actually separate, I mean to open up his left brain, separate the higher self from the lower self, say, look, I, I look at himself and judge yourself, and it's right, his left brain start kicking in, that's the only way he's going to be able to conquer it, but they refuse to do that, and it's, they're a long way from doing that, you know, because they hide from other people that's going to, uh, how could I put it, ignite that left brain, meaning is tell them about themselves. They kind of surround themselves around people that's not going to do that, right. so that's even worse. They lock themselves even deeper into their own trickery. But I just keep it, they, and they do this. They actually keep themselves surrounded by people who won't tell them about themselves and they shit. That's why they hate my ass so much on my goddamn page. They fucking hate me. Exactly. They, you sound like God, or you sound like why they in the la la land thinking they're the shit under the uh, white supremacy shit. You come in the door under the black power, like, nigga, get, you know, and they're like, whoa, and all the party stop. You know what I'm saying? That's what the fuck you look like. The party, the niggas who come stop the party. Tell me about Orion. I heard you say Orion. I might, I know this. I just want to hear you. When you, when you early, you said okay, like those when, when your video kicked off, you said, you know, you got the Orion up in there, and you were talking about the Orion influence. What, what you mean by that? Well, that's when we go, that's when we go so fast, so far from uh, so so high, high in knowledge that you come off the earth or off the mountain. You know, because when you real high, you like to go. You like the bottom, and you on the fucking mountain looking down. You just perceive everything. But when you go as high as we go, you out of space. And when you go out of space, you fucking realize, like, oh, this aliens out here, it's a, it's a, it's some whole other shit. You start understanding shit on a whole intergalactical level now. Now you become like your ancestors under the space travel act. And you think the face out on the moon type shit. So basically what I'm saying is that this nigga is connected to Orion. That's a little bit deeper than just a bullshit ass preacher or something. He's connected to the, the he's like their main source of food. He brings in a lot of food, you know what I'm saying? He got the best shit at all these type shit. <laughs> but he more people up. Just like Hitler. Hitler was connected to Orion. The shit. That's how he became of that shit. You know what I'm saying? T D Jakes, they kinda like they really don't give a fuck about him. He just, you know. But what is Orion? An alien group. Drake codes, Drake car, what they on the Drake Pope, Drake Car, you know, the, the Drake Cars, the alien group, you know what I'm saying, that believe in the, the reptilian, the supreme lower self, you know what I'm saying, that's what they are. Uh, uh, and then you got Ra, you know what I'm saying, that's another alien group. But it's for the black man, it's, the, it's, the, it's kin to the black man. But it's an alien group, it's alien, goddammit, that you want to call it. You said Ra is kin to the black man or Ra is kin to the black man? Ra, Orion is, is, is the white man nature, the white, the uh, uh, Orion made. Nordics. The Drake cars made the right man, yeah, like that. The black man been here. We've been angry. We've been kicking it. And all of a sudden, these niggas come out of nowhere type shit. So the Orion group is like a group of white aliens with blue eyes and blonde hair? They're behind the, the, the elites. They're the ones who run the elites. What is, you see the top. We're talking about Nordics. The Nordics? The uh, you, the way you, you look at the Nordics like this. That's a descendant of them, of their first creation. So when you see the Nordic, the raw version of it, like, like this is what we made, and we made it in a way where it, we can't touch these niggas. We can't physically really get in them, so we're going to create a being that we can put ourselves in to get in them. And that's what you got, niggas made in America. What was the purpose of making Orion? How do, like, where, where did they come from? Another uh, galaxy, Orion. The galaxy of Orion. They from Orion. Their job is to what? Correct? You said something about correcting the put the what you say? Like they was put here to correct us or to put arbitrate on on 
It started off as a good thing. You know, they came through to try to speed up the evolution. That's when you get the Adam and Eve story. Speed up the evolution by doing fucked up things, devious shit. But, you know, the end goal is to speed up the evolution. But in the process, the shit, they became fucked up. You know what I'm saying? And they left the good part out about helping and said, oh, we can control motherfuckers. So that's how it went. In the beginning of the raw essence of it, it was a plan to speed up Earth evolution to Earth people. But then all of a sudden, the shit got corrupt in the end, you know, towards the end. So they started controlling motherfuckers and feeding off motherfuckers. Like, hell no, we can use these motherfuckers as a food source. You just never know what the fuck is a food source. It could be rocks. It could be the fact that you step on rocks all day. That's how they eat, so they keep your ass moving all day. It could be just the fact that you at work, so they keep motherfuckers at work with that energy at work. They, they harness their energy and they feed off the shit. You never know. And you believe Joel Osteen is connected to the Orion group? Yeah, yeah, he is. Yep. Through what, covert hypnosis, signals in the signals, or gin, or all that, all that shit. He's part of the race. He's 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 part of he's an offshoot of what they created. They created him. Yeah, all that shit. You know, you see the blue bean science. You see the third hour with the fight in it. You see these symbols. You know what I'm saying? You look at the motherfucker. You can tell that. Yeah, you know, this nigga don't look right, you know what I'm saying, like a Barbie doll or some shit, like a Ken doll, you know, you can see the shit. <laughs> so I not, know. You know, he don't have a soul. This picture of a black preacher preaching and him preaching. You hear that voice, that, that calm, that not calm, but that, uh, that monotone shit? That's the difference. The black preacher got a soul, a spirit, fire, rock. You hear it, you feel it. He got the monotone, uh, that shit. What's, how do Pisces play in with Orion Group? Because that was a that was that was a they would they study that they know the zodiac and its effects on human thinking and being. So they came to the conclusion that the Piscean, especially the Piscean, but the water energy was the most susceptible susceptible to the tools they had to use at this time to their technology. Earth, oh, he resists. He's stubborn. You know, he can't use that shit. Fire. He angry. He he gonna learn too fast. We can't use that. Uh, I mean, air fire. He got an ego, and he he kind of cool, but he might turn into a fucking warrior and rebel against us. So, what's water? Emotions. Okay. So what we can do with the emotions? Learn how to harness weapon. Use our weapons to, to learn the emotions. What color? You know, the moon ring. What color it is, and what that means when that happens. So we can set up realities for them to indulge in. See what I'm saying? But first, we got to put everybody in the predominant gold, the predominant man frame under the water energy. We got the water technology. So what do we do? We study all the water traits. And we give all that to the earth. We give all that to this, the matrix, the water shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's cool to be to say one thing and do another. It's cool to not open up your church doors. It's cool to, you know, sh all that shit that be on. It's, it's cool. You can do bogus shit and get away with it. You just ask for forgiveness. That's it. I just ask for forgiveness and you keep doing it. And in that state, you never correct yourself. You just keep asking for forgiveness. And that's the fucking way we in a fucked up state in the world today. It's never no self-correction. Like law, earth is law, the pharaoh. You know, the pharaoh, that's why, you know, you're like, hell no, nigga, that's law. We ain't going like, you know, you nigga, did you say, did you eat that, did you do it? You know, that type of shit. So pretty much that's what it boiled down to. They knew that their energy, they... They nature in the low in the lower self, in this lower self was best suitable for their weapon. First of all, the emotional. So it's easy to control the emotional just with signals. So if I can create a create a high signal to make you feel good and a low signal like that, then you, you gonna respond and it's easy. All I'm doing is push a goddamn button. Bipolarism is just a motherfucker plug that got him pushing buttons back and forth doing this, just playing with him like do 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 That's all yeah, bi Instead of bipolar, like bipolar Pisces. There's a lot of them for bipolar. Right. But I'm saying they external beings more so. They feel. So if I can control how you feel, I can control you. Think about it. It don't never have to be a reason. A lot of these motherfuckers, if you see the other signs, will think of a reason why they act the way they act. But with them, it don't never have to be a damn reason. You see what I'm saying? To the point where they be like, why the fuck am I mad? Why the fuck? You know, it don't have to be a reason. You know, why the fuck are you acting like it don't have to be a reason? They're the only ones who are doing that. Mm. Everybody else will kind of look at their ways. So it don't matter so if I'm right, it's just going to be an emotional reaction. It don't matter that, that what I'm saying is actually right. That's easy to work with. If I can pump your emotions under the Zazel Act, 
If I could set a reality where this happened, that happened, happened, and by the time you go to this party, you already on 10, and then all I need is a perfect setup, a person to do some stuff on your shoe, and you kill a motherfucker, that's easy. It's easy for the shadow wall. It's easy for the alien technology. It's easy. It's simple as hell. That's why a lot of niggas in jail. Come on, so let, me, let me ask you about, you, like, just for those who don't know. Mind you, this is all review for me, but you keep saying the shadow walkers. What, what is it? Can you break that down real quick? What is the shadow walker? That's an entity. That's a that's an entity. That's more so like 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 a, 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 a entity or a spirit. You know, as we call spirit, but it's a negative spirit. It's a negative entity, and it's been around like the jinn. The the, the the Islam is called the jinn, the whispering jinn. You know what I'm saying? They even tell you it's an entity, but it's ancient, and they've been around so long they don't even know why they're here. You know, if you ever watch Death Note, the story of the of the Gumagachi, I mean, whatever the fuck it is. <laughs> They don't know why they work. So all they do is just fuck around all day, fuck niggas up, you know, do all type of weird shit, you know, weird to us, but, you know, it, 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 it might make sense to them, it might not, they don't give a fuck. They find pleasure in fucking niggas up, put it like that. So they got shit else to do. So what they do is they set situations too, you know what I'm saying? But they've been on, they, they, are, they part of Earth. The alien ain't from Earth. These motherfuckers are part of an Earth energy, an Earth spirit. From negative niggas that died and come back and harness into these motherfuckers and they've been around since eons. They don't obey no laws, but they own. And their own law is um if you can fuck up a god body, that's how you thrive in the economy. If you so, can fuck up a nigga So how do how do that relate with Pisces? Are they easy? Because the shadow wall was no one thing. They control by their emotions. So all the shadow walls have to do is sit back and assimilate to their emotions because they, they out their body. So when the heart rate go up, what happens? Your, your drilling go up. When your drilling go up, you go into animalistic thinking. When you're in animalistic thinking, you ain't really thinking. That's why it's a jail full of niggas saying, what the fuck was I thinking? What do you mean animalistic thinking? Okay, when you ever did some shit, you're like, what the fuck was I thinking? That means something else controlled your body, took over your body at that time. Or you should know why the fuck you did what you did. You shouldn't even be sitting somewhere like, what the fuck was I thinking about? So at that particular time, something else took over your body. That was a shadow walker assimilating to your blood and your heart rate. Once he figured it out, he, he, he the spirit, the energy jumped into you. You blacked the fuck out. So you mean like Agent Smith from The Matrix and Azazel from Fallen? Azazel, yeah. You remember when they came back, they, Azazel jumped out their body. They didn't know what the fuck they did. They were sitting there like, dude, still thought he had a job. They're like, nigga, after what you did yesterday, he's like, oh, what did I do? That's you sitting in the jail cell like, what the fuck was I thinking? Damn. Exactly, the Zazel, Shadow Walkers. Okay, the Zazel is the Shadow Walkers. They, that is, the, the Jews broke it down for you, gave it to you from the Christianity point of view and showed you what that is. In the movie, you saw the movie Falling with Denzel Washington, just so people are not clear on what, what we're talking about. If, if you ain't seen Falling, yeah. go see Falling with Denzel Washington. That's, that's basically what Zazel was the, the spirit that could jump from body to body. He's like, or, or what they call Jinn, or the genies in, um, in um in Islam, and I noticed today too. I was looking at the word oxygen and nitrogen, and they all end in gin. It's a lot of uh like you think about oxygen and what ends in the word gin, which is what you fucking breathe in all day. And I realized that today. Yeah, it's just oxygen yeah. and ends in or gin. But yeah, think about breath of life. Breath of life. So it's the breath. But when you say whispering gin, that's the dark breath. That's the whisper. That's the low. That's the subtle. That's the stubble. That's the manipulation. See what I'm saying? It's the breath. So what they do is, you, you go to the liquor store, you see gin, spirit. Why is they using these words? Because the spirits in them bottles. The shadow walk don't know. We keep making this shit. This, this like, this like tenderizing the meat. You know, the shit won't be so tough. So the liquor is the tenderizer. When you drink liquor, to them it's tender. They tenderizing your ass. So they call it spirits. Like it's easy. They open your ass up, and really, when niggas drunk, you already know how that go. So liquor and Pisces is a is a good mix to. To, um... Nigga, they can take the whole body for days like that. Nigga, shit. <laughs> that's what it is. They can have a nigga for a week on your ass. So that's why we look. So, so why are we looking at all of these? Uh, like, mind you, you ain't see nobody putting together all of these facts of Pisces. Try showing that all of these Pisces being exposed like this. Why do you think this? What's your take on that? On why you think this is happening right now? There is just all of these. Like you look at Rob Kardashian, Bow Wow. Like I said, Beanie Siegel. You look at Joel Osteen. You look at uh, Bobby Valentino. You look at uh, Rob Patel. What that dude? You look at um. You said Floyd Mayweather won his fight. You know what I'm saying? But you look at the the um. 
the the synchronicity with you know what I'm saying with him and and what 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 do you what is going on with Pisces right now that's that's making all this attention drawing on Pisces right now? Because we're coming out of the age of Pisces into the age of Aquarius, and when you're sipping out of the bullshit, I can get away with murder. You go into the actual law, and that's the judge, and I know you can't, nigga. So they all of them being exposed spiritually, symbolically. This is what you see is they're being exposed. It's the end of their time, and and the only reason. Floyd Mayweather will run the fight, you know what I'm saying, is because he can't read. So his mind ain't assimilated to the language which will bring forth a thinking pattern for the shadow walkers to fuck with. They like it to him and it's like, it's like, you know, they like the fuck, I can't, I don't even, you see, you can't read. So that's how he won that. He, he, he found, by him not being able to read, he found the loophole under the Pisces season, under the Pisces shit. Because that's what I said. I, I said that, that's funny you said that, because I had that exact same conversation with somebody and I told him, I was like, man, it's good for Floyd that Floyd can't read because like that he like all the way Pisces and that like it's certain Pisces who hear that and they understand like instantly like that's why that nigga is the champ and that like that nigga can't even read like all that nigga do is fight like he is just that's that's all he focus on like and that got a lot of Pisces who who want to focus their energy like that but can't because they be too locked into the matrix and, and then like when you go in the Floyd chamber like that's that nigga chamber like it ain't no it ain't no let me tell you, let me tell you. You got Mike Tyson sitting there, he's in the fight. The night before the fight, he sees bad bitch, he sees pussy, he sees ass, and they show a sexy story and they tell a sexy dialogue. So you know he's going there and skeeting the hole and he lose the fight. Floyd Mayweather ain't gonna fall for the shit. He don't even, he can't read. So it, the shit ain't even hitting across his subconscious like that. Right. So all he's all the way Pisces. That's all the way Pisces. He's a lion that's still in, like, like, that's still in the jungle versus a lion that's in the zoo. So most yeah. of the Pisces out here is in the zoo, but he's still in the jungle, basically. He's still in the jungle. He's still in the jungle. That's the only thing that saved his ass. So that's a symbol for Pisces to say what? Got hope. They got hope. <laughs> Y'all got hope, goddammit. That's God trying to repent. That means you got hope. That's what that is. Somebody got to have hope because, you know, everybody just can't be fucked up. You know, you got to give them some hope. It just can't be all bad. You know, they got to have hope. They got to be a way out. I follow this. I follow this. I look at, I, you know what I'm saying? I look at the synchronicity behind Pisces, you know, Pisces. And then I look at Floyd. He's 50 and old. He retired. He, he out of that. You know what I'm saying? And the, the way that that whole fight moved in that direction, you know what I'm saying? I knew that there was no way that he, he was going to lose that fight. It was like, got like. He worked through God. He all he all the way Pisces type shit. And it was like Joe, like when you when well it is is when certain Pisces get that that shit and they cross all the way over. Like you look at Joe Lucy until this happened, you would think that that's where he was, exactly where Floyd was. It's like like you look at it, it was it was perfect. It was like man, that's a Pisces that and totally elevated. And then you look at that and it's like man, it's like oh shit, like like well. You know, the one dude was a water sign too, and he set the stage for itself anyway. Because you never know, you you don't know that Pisces need that me against the world. So that's why Floyd kind of let him talk shit, and everybody like made himself the underdog again. He needs to go against the grain. He needs to lean against the odds to, to, to get that strength. So the dumbass white boy, not knowing the zodiac, was playing right into Floyd's shit. He, he used to. <laughs> yeah, you know, not in the right. He did. Floyd needed that. Right. He needed that. He played the martyr, the martyr, the Jesus link. Like, oh, therefore forsaking me, crucify me, and he let me put me on the cross, and niggas hitting them. And they're like, why did he let them do that? Why did Jesus let them do that? That's Floyd. Why did he let them talk to him like that? You know, that shit. But then he, didn't know, he didn't know that that was Floyd's strength. You know what I'm saying? That was his strength because he all the way Pisces. So he knows exactly what the fuck to do. Right. Naturally. Naturally. He all the way. He don't know how to read, so he in his rest for We'll be ruthless to it. We, we we did something and didn't know how to read one, like connected to right, the right. To, to the a language, you know, we shit, but we kinda the zoo zoo lives. We in the zoo too. We mean you did was it's like a jungle that's in its real form in the zoo. Ah, you gotta imagine that. Yeah, that's real shit. <laughs> that's real shit. So ultimately, you know what I'm saying, Joel Osteen ended up passing the plates around. He still took up another collection at church. You know what I'm saying? People were still putting them on blast. And then he, he said, he told the members, he said, don't have a, uh, oh, feel sorry for me mentality. And then he went to New York and asked New York to donate to Harvard. So I think he's desperate. 
And mind you, you know, what's then happen, you go to his Wikipedia page, it's already listed on his Wikipedia page. You know what I'm saying? And they, they say on there that he doubled back and that he contradicted himself. It's said right there on the Wikipedia entry. You see what I'm saying? So it's part of his history. And the, the fact that it's a flood, the fact that it's a flood is, 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 is the poetry emotion behind the whole shit to me. You know what I'm saying? And that, you know what I'm saying? I ain't really had to go all the way in on the, and that's why I really wanted to bring you in. And like, people know my page. Like, people already know what I, how, what I would say, all that. You know what I'm saying? But like, I really wanted to bring you in just to, 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 to get a, to bring a different dynamic in that. Like, you know, it's because let me, let me give you, let me give you what you asked for right this for the for the tours and for the for the whole wrap up. The reason he's there, the reason we using him, the reason the universe uh, pointed out us, made, you know, asked us to do this, is because he's telling the Pisces, he's a perfect example of the Piscean mind. Like, you got to own up to your shit. You got to separate yourself from that lower self shit. And you got to eventually, you're going to have to do this. And if you don't, you're going to be fucked up. You're going to fall deeper into bullshit. But on the way, you're going to think you're getting over. But when you look up, you're going to be fucked up. And that was giving them the idea of how it would look if you don't get off this bullshit. He ain't looking in the mirror judging himself. He ain't got them in trying to really sincerely help. Even if he fucked up, he ain't saying, well, you know, I fucked up. I had to change the heart. He could have used that shit. God put the real spirit and got out. He ain't even willing to do that. So he really fucked up. You know what I'm saying? God give him ways out, but they don't take it. So this really showing the fact that he's a Pisces, a Floyd, and is hitting their subconscious, like, why we coming out the end, the end of y'all season, which is judgment day for you motherfuckers, you need to not do this. You need to not do this. So what how, how, how I should have did then if I not do that? You knew damn well in the back of your mind you had the other voice, remember the fish going in two directions, saying, Joe, you need to get out there helping people. But I don't want to lose this. Uh, you need to help the people. But I don't want to die. You need to help the people. But I'm sniffing coke right now. You need to help the people. Man, they going to fuck up my church. Help the people. That's how I look. That's what he was going through. But he flunked. And he thought he was just going to be able to pull the wool off of people's eyes because he's sitting there with a mountain of cocaine and a, and, a, and a fucking lion in a motherfucking cage. And he feels like he can't be touched. That's why. So the, the prime example was a lesson for you niggas need to start looking in the mirror. You know you be on that bullshit. Get off the bullshit and practice what you preach. And you're going to reign supreme like Floyd Mayweather. That's hope. But until you do that, ain't no more fucking around. And you know as, they, as I'm talking and you talking, they still going to try to pull it. So some learn the hard way, which a lot of them, I mean, a lot of them learn the hard way, most don't learn it in the simple way. They need to go off what they see, not what the fuck they think they see, not what they want to see, you know what I'm saying? Everything to them is their own made-up world. They get engulfed in their own little illusion. So with the shit he said, he don't think nobody's seeing it until it's too late, and somebody read off the history, the record back to him. But you don't want to go there. You don't want to get that low. Nigga, just confess to your sins. Jesus lived. That's what the Jesus thing is. It's a Piscean religion. Confess to your sins. Give up the bullshit. Give up the Holy Ghost. Be like shit. You know what? I need to be out here helping people and get off this bullshit. And that's what he should have did. But he started playing around. You know what I'm saying? So he flunked. And God's going to show you what it looks like when you totally flunk. If you keep following him. Yeah. Yeah, but he used your whole thing because he, he, it's, it's very interesting. Like, how can a man like this, or this statue, this, this illusion, this guy, all that money and white people fall? And this how God showing you, you think I crack this nigga, I can't crack your ass, and all you got to you know, nigga, please. That's why. And he going to show you how to look in supreme, how to look in the supreme devilish form. When you don't even know, have a clue that you take a sniff and cocaine. And this is what the fuck he doing right now. Damn. Right, like God, I got Oh, you got $300 in your pocket talking about God, God can't bring shit. You know, this nigga got millions. Right, Watch God work. For all the people that's fighting, that's watching this. It's Revelation Day. What do you want to say to them? It's the end of the Bible, y'all. For all you fighting, it's the end of the Bible. Jesus sitting there with a sword dripping in blood. Now, I'm going to tell you what the sword represents. The sword, why Jesus got the sword is because the Pisces age coming into the Aquarian age, you mean you got the two at a point where it mixed. So you got the Jesus, the Piscean energy, the Piscean mind coming into the Aquarian energy, which is the sword, the law, meaning it's a perfect match to fuck a motherfucker up, Joe. Because you got that ether and you got that law, goddammit. The law ain't going in that ether, goddammit, going to make sure he can get them to move off intuition. So it's, 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 it's Jesus dripped in blood today. It's the sword coming to the sword. It's that damn it, the, the, coming out of the age of a Pisces to the age of Aquarius. It's Jesus holding the sword dripping in blood. And that's what you see with the flood. And all the chaos that's going on today. 
If the Pisces motherfucker repent, oh, we ain't got to go through all this shit on a larger scale. So please, you motherfuckers, please, please listen to us. Please stop doing what the fuck you're doing. I, I ain't got time for this shit. Please. <laughs> Straight up. It all is all on y'all. If just 10 of y'all say I give up, we going to be good. It's going to get nice outside. The weather going to be 70 degrees. The weed going to go down. The gas going to go down. Everything going to be cool. It, man, the motor, the motor better. The motor merry. Yep. But see, you know who really. Do it. The comments gonna be fucked up. It's gonna be a bunch of shitload of fucked up shit. The comments they got shit to do with that shit. <laughs> I, got, I, got that. I got something for the motherfuckers who gonna talk shit about this video. All we ask is to go show your people. Yeah, go show it to your people before you. Uh, before you. Talk shit. I say that shit all the time. They don't never listen to that shit. As a matter of fact, half the time they come back and delete that goddamn comment after that shit. Before we go, why don't y'all show y'all people? So if you listen to, if you hear this, please comment. Why when y'all hear blah talk shit a week, so called talk shit? Why I, don't I, you? I can give you like ten different reasons. They say, well, for one, are oh, you just trying to get extra views? They say, oh, you trying to get extra views? They say, oh, uh, why would I show this to my people if because you're fucking crazy? Because you're crazy nah, nah, in it? Nah, because nah, they go, it's like nah. I hear every reason, dude. It's it's like that ain't gonna shit. That's like a child. That's like a child. That's a shorty shit. No, nah, nigga, yeah, I'm talking exactly. about really going to do shit. <laughs> And have them tight why we wrong. No. Have your people tight why we wrong. Let's do that. How about that? Have them tight why we wrong. Let's do that. I doubt one of you motherfuckers do that. And if y'all when y'all see that, that don't happen, when y'all see that that don't happen, then y'all gonna know we reign supreme. Go have your people tight what they feel about this video, knowing you a price. Yeah. Hold on, let me see. I got it. this shit got eighty eight thousand views on this motherfucker. It is how many comments on this motherfucker? It's over 5,000 comments on this motherfucker. And I ain't heard every excuse of why they ain't not going to show their people. So trust me, they ain't not going to show their people. You know Never, nigga. That's like, that's like you're robbing a bank. You got the money in your hand, and you just say, fuck it, take the mask off and show your life. <laughs> <laughs> that ain't going, nigga. <laughs> that ain't going. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you know what you mean? <laughs> Hell no. Uh, they ain't stupid. They ain't stupid. That's one thing. They ain't stupid now. Uh, let, me, let me wrap this shit up. Let me wrap this shit up. Man. Joel seen is obviously Pisces as hell. You know what I'm saying? I just wanted to, like I said, I ain't want to go on my typical rant. I, I want to bring my brother Pony and I appreciate him for, you know what I'm saying? Giving a different insight on the page, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna leave a link in the description for his video. Make sure you check that out too. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate uh, the female who, man, it's kind of bogus. I remember name, but so, you know, what I'm I appreciate the people who leave the comments and who be leaving the information. Man, I, I appreciate y'all. Y'all really got this shit cracking. Y'all kind of sub, kind of requested this video in a, in, a, in a in a different type of way. So I appreciate y'all bringing me the information. Keep sending me the links. Keep letting me know what the fuck is going on. I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you sign up Godspeed.main.com. What you say? Let me say something before I forget. Uh, I was going to say, when y'all look at my video about, you know, the Joseph Osteen Frequency and Orion, please remember that the other video I posted prior to him having that sermon, everything I said was before that sermon. And if you listen closely to everything I said, even David, you're going to hear that he was in David and he, he kicking that why me, why and for me shit. And then, and then you ask yourself, how do I know this? So if I'm not right like that, you know that nigga too seafood. You know that nigga hitting that cocaine. So, but, so no, everything I said was prior to that sermon, way before that sermon. Maybe the, the first, I can say about a 10 hour difference. That's all I got to say. Yeah, he, he, he probably doing some mercy cocaine now after this shit. Trust me, he needs some shot in cocaine. Uh, he kicking it with motherfucking future, Joe. He popping Molly Perkins in and shit. You know what I'm saying? They got the tight white. He went and bought a bottle of uh, some motherfucking Jordans and shit. And he got a, a, a Van Halen shirt on that got Metallica on there. I don't know where the fuck he get that at. And his goddamn his wife sitting there with some Fandex on and a titty that was with some, um, some um, um, what you call it? Some um, clothes clippers on the motherfuckers, you know what I'm saying? She going off the leaf. They got that from Ray Ray off 79. Yeah.
It only gets evil. That's what the black hoodie means. When you say that the cards are to roll, it only get dark. It means it only get dark. It only get darker. They only get darker, Joe. As a world could crumble, they only get darker. Yeah, that's why some of them are I'm gonna be on that suicidal shit and be killing themselves like the um like the guy in Lincoln Park. Um Chester Bennington, that's the guy from Lincoln Park who killed himself. You know what I'm saying? Uh he hung himself, I think it was on uh July the 19th or July the 20th of 2017, you know, and like, you know, there was somebody in my comments that suggested I go look at his last interview and a lot of things he was saying, he was talking about like how he didn't want to be here no more and he couldn't communicate, he was having trouble communicating and he was just super depressed and his birthday had just passed and he didn't do shit but shit up in his house and watch TV all day and you know what I'm saying? And he was just super depressed. He ended up killing himself. You know what I'm saying? Like, I understand. That's <laughs> everything, he just, everything you just stated was the, 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 the state of a God body. So think about that. And then he killed himself. Everything you just stated is what the God body go through. And, but he killed himself behind the shit. Right. Yeah. Right. He a Pisces. So, <laughs> you know. Ain't too, so, you know, ain't no nigga gonna kill himself like, unless the law chasing him into a corner and he might do it. But like even then, like ain't no nigga about to kill himself. No, they they the matrix. They gonna go. They the matrix. They the creative being. They gonna go. We can't oh, just jump off. Know, matter of fact, this is a, well, I ain't gonna even get that nigga plugged. But I know a singer who who brother killed himself. And I asked because he got a song out about this. he was rapping to his brother who killed himself. He was a black dude. You know what I'm saying? And I asked him, I was like, man, when was his birthday? And he told me his birthday was on March 20th. He was a Pisces. And it might be that's Mr. Roger's birthday. And uh, it's a couple yeah. people born March uh -huh. But yeah, like, yeah. It's, it's, it is. I ain't that Pisces. And they say, oh, I want to kill myself. That shit. Like, they do. Like, Kurt Cobain killed himself. He's a Pisces. You know what I'm saying? He left a suicide note. That's when thought go wrong. You know, that's when being a mortal, the Jesus thought go wrong. That's all that is. The Jesus thought going wrong. Yeah. I think you had told me some shit about, you said the. Uh, the rod, the rod, the, uh, the the council of rod. They had said something like Jesus wasn't supposed to do that. Like, didn't you say something? Okay, like that? okay. yeah, that's very important. I'm glad you said that. They was talking about Jesus had seen star seeing the scorch. Hold on, first you say they. Who is they? I just want to be clear. Rod, if you ever listen to the thing, the tapes of I am Rod, it's, it's a channel. It's a channel when it, back in this days. Some people channeled this this in its entity, and it was Ra. It was the Ra God, the Sun God, the the, the Amen Amen Ra, you know. And by them channeling it, he was telling them things about Earth that when nobody that nobody knew, but you knew this shit was true. So basically, he told them. They asked him about Jesus and this and that, and he told them where Jesus had got distorted. Jesus had got tricked over time into thinking that he had to die for his people. He said, in reality, how what, what, why would you have to die instead of just live on to your fullest potential and put your full effect into the earth? And naturally, if you choose to pass, why would you allow yourself to die? So that in that, they say he should have just kept living. He wasn't supposed to do that, get on the cross, let himself be killed. He was supposed to test the powers that he had. So when they tried to kill him, he was supposed to turn him into a ghost. When they tried to do that, he was supposed to, he was supposed to show the world that the world is at his neck. But he like an X-Man, he didn't get up out of this shit. So you got Rodney and Wade, like, yeah, it's gonna go down, and this nigga get on the cross and say, kill me. They like, oh, hell no, nah. y'all ain't gonna end the movie that quick. That's like with Mike Tyson, if you pay all that money, you get ready to fight me, knock a nigga ass out. We the audience, I am Rod, we the audience, like, man, what the fuck, hold on, wait, wait, wait. That's what it is. <laughs> the, movie got, the movie was over too damn quick. Rod like, come on, man, Jesus, we just got you ready, and you gonna go let them kill you? You ain't even try to pray. You ain't even try to do the raw. You ain't even try to do the three point break. You ain't. You know what I'm saying? Mm. So they had to build another. They had to build more, which you don't have that meaning. They put more of the warrior spirit in them, which is the, 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 what we're going into the age of Aquarius. They already knew that the God, the Messiah, was coming back between the age of Aquarius and at the end, of, in the, at the end of age of Pisces and the beginning of the age of Aquarius. Yeah. So this one gonna be fair. He's not gonna kill himself because first of all he detached from emotions. If they weaponry is emotional weaponry, and under the air files you become detached from emotions, so they weaponry get weaker. So they start focusing more on the information and shit like that. But they weaponry, their old weaponry get weaker. So we become stronger because now we mix with the Piscean, the the energy that we is in the ether. We is supreme right brain, but now our left brain is kicking in with this right brain. So now you have a problem because the children are coming in now going to be both balanced. And, then they're going, and now that we're under the age of uh, going into the age of Aquarius, 
Is it going to be left brain kicking in? You are predominantly right brain. Now you're going to be ruthless. They can't fuck with you. And it's going to be a sight to see. Mm. Yeah. All right. Let me see. see this shit up for real, man. All right. I'm out, man. My phone's in the dash. So I'm going to ride. Godspeed. Godspeed name.com. Holler at me. All right. Let me say it. Make sure you sign up for Godspeed.name. Make sure you sign up for, for X.com. We out.